So hopefully y'all don't mind me doing this little sit down video in the car. I'm honestly just trying to get out the house. I've been going crazy in the house. So just trying to do different stuff and get out of my routine. So hopefully y'all don't mind. But I want to talk about a topic. I want to talk about how to stand out as a photographer. And I feel like it's really hard these days. And I don't know, the market is, the photography industry is very saturated. It's a lot of competition. So it's a lot of people doing photography and it can be tough to stand out amongst so many other photographers. So I wanna give y'all some tips to help you stand out as a photographer. So first off, I think when people think about standing out, they initially think about images, like how can I stand out with my photos? I think you can go really deeper than that because as a photographer, it's not just about the photos. And this is something that I always say because it's true, you know, Anybody could take a good photo, you know? So it's like, how else can you stand out? What else do you have to offer to clients? How was your experience? Like these are the things that you need to be thinking about when you're trying to really, you know, crunch down on what makes you unique and what's gonna make you stand out amongst other people. And honestly, it's a lot of great photographers out here. Like even in my area, College Station, Texas, man, it's some beasts photographers out here who just take amazing photos and you may think sometimes when you see people like that you're like man i'm just not on their level i can never get my business to their level because they're so good but then on the other end of the spectrum you see a lot of people who photography wise skill wise they're not the best and their business is still thriving and it's still growing because they've really leaned into what makes them unique and it's other things that they have a value to offer clients just besides photos so my biggest tip would be to lean into what makes you unique. You really have to sit down and think about what is my skill set? Like, what am I really good at? Like with me, myself, I've even wrote these things down. Like, what am I really good at when it comes to not just photos, but other aspects of my business? Like, what's my communication like? Am I good with communication? Um, just what's my whole experience like? Like, these are things that I would recommend writing down. Like, what are your strengths? And I think the best thing that you can do is to lean in your strengths. Maybe you're a people person. Okay, so get out there, talk to people and really let your personality shine. And that's really gonna help you stand out. Or maybe you're a person who pits a lot of effort into the client experience, like how you make your clients feel, sending them little personalized notes and messages and gifts. That's something, if that's your strength, that's something that you should lean into. Because honestly, it's a lot of photographers who just focus on the photos and they don't really invest in their client experience, you know, whether it be sending your client just a thank you card. Um, I think that goes a really long way and says a lot about you as a person and that it really shows that you care that, you know, you just took the time out of your day to send your clients a thank you card and maybe a gift after the wedding or after the session. That really goes a long way. And that's something that we implement in our business. And I think it's really helped us and helped us grow our business. Also with our business, we really focus on clear and just great communication, great customer service and and our client experience. Y'all have seen me talk about that. But those are things that we've said, you know, this is our strong point and we're going to really focus on that and push that. And, you know, we know we're not the best photographers in the area. We're just not there yet. So what, like I was saying, what else can we focus on? And we identified that people really vibe with our customer service, the way we communicate. You know, we've had a lot of people say, just thanks for being there. Thanks for showing that you care. Thanks for helping me. This is something that we really push. You know, we help our clients with, with everything, you know, styling. If we're shooting a wedding, we're helping them kind of plan the wedding. Just being that person that's gonna be there and actually care. That's our whole thing. That's our motto. We're photographers who actually care. And that's not a knock on any other photographers, but that's what makes us special. That's our unique, I guess you could say, selling point is we really care about our clients. We care about your experience working with us and not just delivering you great images. And I'm not saying you can't stand out image wise. That's something else that you could really focus on to stand out. For example, we shoot with off camera flash. It's not a lot of photographers in our area that shoot with off camera flash. And, you know, if you shoot with flash, it produces a whole different look from natural light. And I feel like just the creative possibilities of you know types of images that you can get with off-camera flash is just way more than you can get with natural light so i just wanted to touch on that point i'm not saying you can't stand out with your images you can but because the industry is so competitive and, and photographers these days are so good you have to offer other things you have to stand out in other areas you have to like pinpoint where other people are slacking 
and really focus on that. And that's something that could really help you stand out a lot. So what I want y'all to do, I think this will really help you out if you're trying to figure out how you can stand out amongst a lot of different photographers. Like I said, you want to sit down and write down, don't not photos, not talking about photos and gear and none of that stuff and upgrading your camera, none of that stuff. That stuff don't matter, you know? Think about your strengths. Think about what makes you unique. Think about your brand. That's something else that can really help you stand out. Like how does your brand differ from other people? And you see that in the industry a lot, a lot of photographers that have this same brand. Everybody's just becoming copycats. You know, why not break the norm and offer something different? Be different, you know? So these are things that you really need to think about. Once you have your strengths down and what makes you unique, you know, think about how you can incorporate this into your photography and your photography business, you know, even your personality. Like, how can I incorporate this in my client communication? How can I incorporate this in my photo shoots? How can I incorporate this in my brand? Hopefully this video helped you out. I've just been wanting to freestyle a lot of videos and just talk about what's on my mind. And I don't know, I don't wanna talk about generic topics on this channel all the time. Like, you know, just regular how to's and all that stuff. That stuff gets boring. So I just wanna kinda of dig deep with this whole photography thing. And that's what you can expect on my channels for me to dig deep into different topics and not just talking about gear cameras and lenses that stuff is cool but if you're really trying to grow and connect with clients and build your brand you got to dig deeper than that stuff you got to get past that whole mindset of just gear and all that stuff lights whatever all that stuff clients don't care about that stuff you got to figure out what makes you unique how can i let my personality shine with my brand what is my brand what do i stand for what's my unique selling point besides producing great images if you're new to the channel check out my other videos i have a lot of videos helping beginner photographers intermediate photographers just photographers in general i talk about the business side i talk about gear sometimes too giving recommendations and stuff like that so check out the other videos on my channel if you enjoyed this video please drop a thumbs up subscribe to the channel i post new videos every single week my wife just pulled up i will see you on my next video peace